seeking his first goal after first year MLS man Liel Abada, their $8 million signing, is 23 year old Tani Oluwase starting, leaving Tamu Puki in a substitute role, set for a good one this match day 10 in Major League Soccer, concluding with two games. This and the California Classico later tonight were underway on the artificial surface on a slick Bank of America Stadium field to guide it away. The fifth year MLS keeper, third straight season as Minnesota's number one. This is Robin Lude advancing back the other way. This ball finds its way to Oluwase and the big save made. He just gets away then you can see so much space and Privet doesn't want to commit himself then the cross comes in. It's a really good early opportunity for Oluwase. But an equally good save from Kalina because he's going one way the other way. It's a great save, but a good opportunity for Minnesota. Now on the ensuing corner by Lude. Cleared out by Charlotte. They'll race onto the loose ball and very quickly four into the attack in transition. Ashley Westwood able to play this, firing away and putting it over the bar. He doesn't know as in terms of where he wants to go first. The ball slowed down a little bit, but then you just see the pace of Vargas. He gets the strike. But yeah, I think what he's trying to be, he's, he's trying to play on the counter attack and be solid. Flag stays down for Charlotte. This ball in the direction of Copetti. Nearly had a second chance at it. Cleaned up by Minnesota, and Charlotte will have it on a throw. These are going to Their $8 million man to whip this ball in, brought down Burin in to play this in. This ball headed and getting a hand to it, St. Clair. That flag stayed down, it's a corner. Play from Urinen because he just puts the ball back where it's come from. And you see just as it's played back, yeah, he's well onside there. It's actually Padelford, who's on that far post, who's playing everybody on. It's a great header, but an even better save from St. Clair. We saw so many times last season, especially away from home, they kept compact and then they just get the ball to him and he was incredible. On his day, one of the best number 10s in the league. Fragapane plays centrally, they hit it first time and going for goal. Will Trapp trying to open the scoring, didn't miss by much. Magnificent strike as well because he's coming to him at pace and it bounces just before it comes to him as well and for him to be able to keep that down. Plays it ahead, Abata, back heel, the blind pass, nobody there except the loons who take it away. In transition, they get it to the foot of Robin Lud. Finish midfielder, plays it ahead. Oluwase waiting on this, able to strike and fires and scores! What a hit by Tani Oluwase. It is Minnesota with the lead on the road, his third goal of the season. Position. He drifts inside, he's saying exactly where he wants it. What he's doing, he's playing on the shoulder of the last defender. This time, you've got Tuoloma and Privet, they've got caught out. It's a great finish, an absolutely brilliant finish from Oluwase. But what he's done, he's gone on the shoulder of Tuoloma. He knows that he can go behind Tuoloma because Privet is deeper than him. So he knows he's not going to be offside. And it's Franco Fragapane, Lud. Terrific touch played out wide. The service coming back in. They get ahead to it, and the player is down in the attacking area. I think that's Robin Lude on the attempt. Indeed, it is. When you have two plays down the left hand side that can get forward, you just see it's actually Lude. He just connects here. It's actually, yeah, just goes into Privet. It's a painful one. Hopefully, it'll be okay. A draw following the 3 2 victory over Toronto last week that saw Patrick Ajiman subbed on to score a game-winning goal in the 85th minute at what point might Charlotte turn to him Fragapane the other way able to square this and it's 2-0 oh a terrific team goal produced once again and Robin Lund with the finish the Loons have doubled the lead on the road so what I said is Charlotte they're being made to go inside so therefore the space is out wide then when Minnesota get it back and it starts with an amazing ball from Ariaga and then the rest they have so much space in those wide areas it's a lovely ball sideways from to Fragapane he puts the ball into the box and then Lude is there in the right place to put the ball into the back of the net and it's the hero last week with the game-winning goal late now on the end swinger and the celebration is on Another goal for Minnesota, and it's taken all the life out of this stadium. It's a 3-0 game. <laughs> and what a performance this is from Minnesota. It's Dotson that gets himself into a great position. I think just at that near post, and it's, he just sees the ball comes across. Yeah, 
and it is. It's a great header from Dodson. Just gets away from his man, just gets on the wrong side. Gets on the wrong side of Tuoloma. And you see the reaction as well. Sota. Just as they get their informed striker into the game, taking all the air out of the stadium. Hassani Dotson, first goal of the season. They work it across. All of Shea. Oh, nearly had a second of the day off the outside of the post. It should have been four. And what they're doing once again, it's using the wide areas. It's defending narrow, breaking wide, getting balls into the box. And all of Shea goes. For We've said about Charlotte before, they want to give you the ball. They want to for you to do all the running. And Minnesota have come here and said, no, 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 you're at home. You're going to do all the running and you're going to be compact. Now Copetti, the flag is up. And the frustration continues for their number nine. First time this season he's come off the bench for the Loons. Return pass. Here's Pookie again from the sharp angle. Save is made by Kalina. Loose ball played out top of the 18. Trap gives it a go and that's blocked away. Team that he's brought together and the players are on side and taking everything on board. Lawrence, big addition from Coventry City, late added to that staff. This is Ajiman trying to put his team on the board. He could not. Four. Means that Minnesota have been able to turn defense into attack really quickly. Westwood able to play this ball in. Cleared out by Minnesota initially. Now Orenin will give it a go and sends it over the bar. It is line. Westwood over the free kick. Westwood able to curl this in. Well, they had it clean. A clean look at goal, but the chance is off the mark. St. Clair to get it away. And that will be all. Minnesota United comes to Bank of America Stadium. Collects a huge road win. They improve to 4-2-2. Two and two. Olawashe.